name is Jeff Cates. I'm the Managing Director for Intuit Canada, and today we're at our head office in Mississauga. conducted research um, really looking at the hiring practices of small businesses. This is kind of an extension of the financial literacy program that we had started last year, looking at what are the major pain points small businesses have in growing their business. What I found interesting is we know that small businesses are the lifeblood of the Canadian economy, right? They, they drive the GDP, they drive the GDP growth, they drive um, a lot of the uh, employment hiring, right? And so what came out of the research is that one third of all small businesses are in that a growth phase. What's interesting is when we look at of those that saying they're going to be in growth mode, 50% say that they're going to hire in the next 12 months. What we found was that small businesses, um, similar to many other areas of usage of technology, is that they're not using the same tools that many medium to large size companies are. So for example, what we found was that 60, just over 60% of small businesses are using kind of their traditional small social networks to hire, right? It's, it's word of mouth. Rather than using tools like LinkedIn that came in closer to 30%, and so what that says is that small businesses are ne not necessarily casting that broad net to make sure that they're hiring the right talent to grow their business. As you go into this, are you thinking about what tools are available for me to help get the best talent in? And so part of that is understanding what are the best hiring practices of, of peers around you in your local area, as well as what tools are available. The barriers that we found from the research that um, is delaying at least people from creating jobs is that they don't know what um, is entailed in, in actually paying an employee. Um, they're a little bit worried about the um, requirements for the government, for example, or the tracking that's required. And if they don't have good tools in place already, they don't have a, a high degree of confidence um, around adding that additional responsibility into their business. That's where tools like QuickBooks Payroll or QuickBooks can help because it gives you that confidence that you know, you know how to run your business, um, you know at all times how much money you have, um, and it helps solve for some of the complexities of how do you re report back to the government, for example? So tools like that give you a better degree of confidence on your business and help solve for a lot of those complexities that go with actually hiring. What's great about um, products like QuickBooks is that you can start off as that single entrepreneur and the application or the service will kind of build with you, um, including things like being able to add on uh, payroll services, right, that integrate into that core application, that, that QuickBooks application, but help make it really simple to be able to pay your first employee and continue to grow your practice um, while saving time and just being more efficient because you're using the tools that um, you, you, know, you need to to run your business, but um, enables you to do other things like paying uh, employees really simply. We see a, a real shift occurring from, you know, traditional desktop world into online. Um, that's one thing. The second is that with that shift is a really changed expectation of how applications connect. You know, an interesting story, we had small businesses come in, we had desktop customers, we had online customers, we had some competitive online customers. And the desktop customer said things like, wow, you know, it's so phenomenal that I can download my bank data. Whereas the online folks are like, well, of course you can do that. It's all connected. And so that's a prime example of just the expectations are different as we move online. And so those two factors have really changed how we are thinking about how we will grow our business. One, we need to be online and global. That just is a given. But we need to think more not uh, as our products as applications, but as our platforms. We believe that the opportunity for us, in particular around small business, is that we can become the small business operating system around the globe. And for us to do that, that means that other applications and services must connect into QuickBooks and that data flows through so that we can help solve new problems that we haven't even thought about by enlisting the help of other developers around the world solving customer problems. 
It's really exciting and we've got great trajectory. Um, I'm really excited about the future, not only for Intuit, but also for the small businesses that will have all this additional information and tools at their fingertips.